In this video, we will be solving a question from sequence and series, and this question came on last J mains or 2023. Let A, B, C, D be positive real numbers. A, B, C, D for real numbers are given such that A plus B plus C plus D equal to what? 11. It's 11. A plus B plus C plus D is 11. If the maximum value of A raised to 5. B raised to B A, A raised to 5 B cube C square into D is 3750 beta, then we need to find the value of beta. How will you find the value of beta? It's given that the power of A B C D. If you add this power, you will get 5 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1, which means the sum of this power is 11, which means we can form 11 numbers. 11 numbers, how can you form? Five numbers having a, a by five, a by five, a by five, a by five, again a by five, and three numbers with a b, b by five, b by three, plus b by three, comma b by three, and three numbers and two numbers having c, c by two, comma c by two, and d only one number. This is how you can form a. 11 numbers, you can form 11 numbers. Now, how will you find the value of this, the maximum value of this? That is one thing you need to remember. Whenever you are having a questions to find the maximum value or minimum value, it may be of the form arithmetic means greater than or equal to geometric means. This is the condition. If arithmetic mean equal to geometric means, which means Arithmetic mean has reached its maximum value. Suppose, which means if arithmetic mean equal to geometric mean, we can conclude two things. That is, if arithmetic mean equal to geometric mean, sum become minimum. Sum become minimum, which means arithmetic mean has become the minimum value and it is equal to geometric mean. That is, the minimum value of arithmetic mean is geometric mean. And the maximum value of geometric mean has reached and it is equal to arithmetic mean when m equal to gm arithmetic mean equal to geometric mean we can conclude two conclusion which means arithmetic mean has the minimum value and geometric mean has the maximum value here we can take the geometric mean if you multiply we will get the power of a raised 5 if you multiply this value we will get the power of b cube if you multiply this value we will get the power of c square and here is d now i am finding the condition that arithmetic mean equal to geometric mean. How will you find the arithmetic mean of these numbers? You need to add these numbers. A by 5, A by 5, A by 5, A by 5, 5 times it will be 5 into A by 5, it will be sum will be A. B by 3, 3 times it will be B. C by 3, 2 times it will be C. And again D, we have the sum. How many numbers are here? Here there are total 11 numbers. So this is the arithmetic mean. And geometry mean, what is the value of geometric mean? If you take the product, you will get the geometric mean and it will be n root, which means the root is 11th root. And if you multiply, what will you get? A into A into A, A raised to 5 divided by 5 square, 5 raised to 5 into B cube divided by 3 cube into C square divided by 2 square into D divided by 1. Now, what is the value of A plus B plus C plus D? It is 11. So this value will be 11. 11 by 11 is 1 equal to 11 the root of a raised to 5 b cube c square d the whole divided by 5 raised to 5 3 cube 2 square. Now I am taking the 11 to power on both sides. If I take 11 to power 1 raised to 11 is 11. So the root will be eliminated. 1 raised to 11 is 1. So the root only will be eliminated. Now what I am doing is this is the maximum value. So if I can, I can take this whole value to this side, it will be 5 raised to 5 into 3 cube 2 square equal to a raised to 5 b cube c square into d. And this is the maximum value. In the question is given that it is 3750 beta. Now I am substituting, equating this value with 3750 into beta equal to 5 raised to 5 3 cube 2 square into 1. Now I can calculate the value of beta. How will I find the value of beta? Just we can calculate. Hmm. 
here what I am doing is I am taking I am writing 10 into 375 as 3 into 125 which is equal to 5 cube into 5 square into 5 raised to 5 I am writing as 5 cube into 5 square into 3 into 3 into 3 square into 2 square now 5 cube and 125 will be cancelling and 1 5 and 2 will be cancelling and it will be here it is 10 will be cancelling and 3 and 3 will be cancelling and here is beta here will be beta the value of beta will be 2 into 5 into 3 square 9 10 into 9 will be 90 the value of beta is 90 this is how you can solve this question